time, you sit in an office from that time, you get a lunch break. Yeah, be that 30 minutes or be that an hour. Go for a walk. Yeah. 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 So there's always that. I get that people have to eat, but the, the, there is always, I'm going for a 15 minute walk, sit down and eat your lunch. That's 15 minutes. You're not only getting exercise, you're also getting fresh air, you're getting that mental break, you're getting that kind of like reset. Or I'm a big advocate for getting up early and getting it done. Yes. So I will set my alarm even 10 minutes before the kids wake up. Yeah. Um, go and boil the kettle, go and get the lunches ready, get the school bags ready. While you're doing that, you, you're moving, you're doing exercise. Yeah. I don't, morning is kind of like, don't pick your phone up, that's, that's the first thing. That's 10 minutes safe. Which is really hard, yeah. by the way. Don't pick your phone up. I never, ever, ever look at my phone first thing in the morning. How do you do that? I need to know. Sorry to interrupt, but I need to know. I just don't. Before I've had a drink, some movement, be that even, you know, five minutes of breathing, take 10 deep breaths, go make yourself a drink, go and brush your teeth, you know, something like that, then look at your phone. Try and add on a little bit more each day where you're phone free. Otherwise, you find that you just get sucked in and you're constantly you're yes. reactive. The second you open your eyes, you look at your phone, you're reactive to something. You can't, any good intentions that you have for the day go out the window. You see that email, you see that message, you see that notification. It's still going to be there in 30 minutes. It's still going to be there in an hour. 